Hello friends, in Zoom latest update they have added a new feature called Zoom apps and it is really interesting and useful feature too. So in today's video I will be sharing with you some of the best apps from it and also cover that how do you install Zoom apps into it. So without wasting any time let's get started. So first of all you must have updated the zoom app. After updating you will see a new option called apps in the right side top corner. Then you will be given an option to add apps. You must not click that. You must go to the discover option in the same place and then you will be able to see lots of apps. Now if you want to access these apps during the zoom meeting then you don't have to come back and do the same process again. For that there is a new option. In the meeting itself there is an option called apps. When you tap on that you will get to the same page but without moving out of the meeting or getting distracted. Now in that you can click on discover option and you can scroll through apps. So now I will show you how to install any of these zoom apps in your computer. For that first you need to tap on the app which you need to install and you will be able to see add option in the right side top corner. Yes because it doesn't install the app directly instead it adds up to the zoom app as an extension like in chrome. So after you click on the add option it will redirect to your browser and there you need to sign up with your zoom account. Then you will get an option called authorize to give permission to the app now you will get a pop up message to open the zoom meeting you should click on it and open now for some time the app will load and it will launch the app so now i will show you some of the best apps in this zoom app list so the first app is warmly using this app we can create custom virtual backgrounds which includes your profile picture name occupation and other details and even you can manage scheduled meetings in this app this will be very helpful for those who attend business conference and other meetings and the second app is rev rev meeting assistant using this app you can do real time transcription and translate the speech into text this can be saved as a conversation or as a text or can be heard after the meeting is ended. This app is very useful for those who take notes and especially for students. The next app is just say the word. Yes, it is not kind of productive or useful app. It is just a fun app which can be used for time pass because it is a game. Like this apps are also there in zoom apps list which you can check out. The next app is similar to the first one but I think it is worth mentioning it separately. It is the pixel app and it can be used to create virtual backgrounds. It has hundreds of preloaded virtual backgrounds and you can change it by clicking just once. So hope you like this video. If you like the video please hit the like, subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notified. I will catch up you in the next one. So bye.